So here we have an addition pyramid. In addition pyramids, two squares next to each other are added to make the square above them. So if we want to know which number to write in this square here, we need to add 3 and 4. So if we're on 4 and we count on 1, 2, 3, we get to 7, so we can write 7 above 3 and 4. Now you might be wondering, how can we find out which number to write in this square here? Well, we know 4 add something makes 9. So if we start on 9 and count back 1, 2, 3, 4, we get to 5. So we can write 5 next to 4, because 4 and 5 make 9. Now we need to add 7 and 9 to find our top square. So if we start on 9, and we count on 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, that takes us to 16. Now pause the video and see if you can solve this addition pyramid. And remember, with addition pyramids, you sometimes need to subtract as well. So here we have 7 plus something makes 12. So if we subtract 7 from 12, counting back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, we get 5. And now we have 7 plus something makes 15. So what can we do? Let's start on 15 and subtract 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And that gives us 8. Now we need to add 12 and 15. So if we start on 15, we're adding 12, so 1, 10 and 2 units. So we move down 1 to add 10, and then 1, 2 places to the right to add our 2 units. So we have 27. Now this question is a bit trickier. Which block do we need to solve first? Which square do we need to solve first? Well, the only square that we can answer is this one here, because we can add 5 and 9. So if we start on 9 and count on 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, we get to 14. Now which of these squares do we need to solve next? Well, we still can't solve this square at the bottom. All we know is that something needs to be added to 5 to make something. But we do know that this square is 14. So we can work out the number of this square next to it. How can we do that? Well, we have 14 plus something is 27. So we need to subtract 14 from 27. So if we start on 27, we're taking away 110 and 4 units. So we can go up to subtract our 10, and then left 1, 2, 3, 4 to subtract our 4 units. And that leaves us on 13. So now we have something plus 5 equals 13. So if we start on 13 and count back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, we get 8.
Now pause the video and see if you can complete this addition pyramid. So I can solve this square here by taking 12 away from 27. So if we start on 27, move up to subtract 10, and count back another 1, 2. So we've subtracted 1, 10, and 2 units, and that leaves us on 15. Now what do we need to do next? Well here we have something plus 8 is 15. So let's start on 15, count back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and that gives us 7. And now something plus 7 is 12. So if we do 12 minus 7, start on 12, and count back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, that gives us 5. 